how I wish that people will realize the importance of the International Eucharistic Congress. It has been started in 1881, and this forthcoming Congress in Cebu is the 51st International Eucharistic Congress. When we gather, then we would have an opportunity to reflect on the importance and the centrality of the Eucharist and the Christian life. We would have a chance to experience the faith of the Filipino people and of the delegates who would come for testimonies. And then we would reflect in a prayerful way what we can do as a sign of gratitude to the Lord for having given himself to us. We know that the Lord gives himself to us as food and drink. We have received him. What do we offer in return? We are aware of the many who hunger for food, for love, for mercy. But we also know of the many who hunger for the word of God and for God himself. And so may this Eucharist be an opportunity for all of us to truly appreciate what God has done and what we have received when we partake of him and also what we can do that others may know that there is a loving God.